Hello, my name is Nico, and I am here to introduce you to the new shader, ocean shader I created for Unity 3D. Um, this shader is working for both uh, indie and pro. That means that even the ones who have uh, the free version of Unity, they can use this shader, and it will look exactly the same. So uh, this shader is written from scratch. No no piece of code taken from here and here, no modification of the Unity shader whatsoever. I had to think um, differently in order to get this result. Um, I could not find any information. I had really to create everything from scratch. Um, what you see is uh, basically one plane, big plane. I just drag and drop the plane from the Unity's primitive and I resize it 10,000 times to so make it huge and I, I, I uh, select the shader and that's what I, I get um, about the feature you have the sun reflection here of course you can change the color of the sun reflection you can move the sun it can be here or here anywhere and uh, you can remove the sun reflection <coughs> if you don't like uh, you have uh, caustics. I like the caustics, uh, but some people don't like. You can you can set them to to be invisible if you don't like them. Uh, as you can see, you don't have a repetitive pattern anywhere. Uh, even from far away, you don't see any looping texture. Even if the waves are made from a, a displacement map but there is no animation uh, you just have to have one uh, bump map texture you can make it from any water picture and you just drag and drop the drum map picture, bump map picture and the uh, displacement map animation and looping will be made by the shader and it loops correctly and make sure that there is no repetitive pattern anywhere so it's some kind of randomness here uh, there is form but there is no form texture the form is just re made by uh, accident when I was made uh, making the the Sun uh, calculation it just generated this kind of things and yeah it looks good the shader is looking good from far away and also you can see it from close it's looking still pretty good I know some people want me to go under the water and yes I'm going to go under the water to show you what's going on okay so I have created some basic underwater feeling because I cannot use I wanted to do something for indie so I cannot use the uh, full screen <coughs> blur but you, of course, if you have pro version, you can use the blur from from the stock uh, image uh, through the shader. You can see it's a different shader from from underwater. So uh, when I'm here and I go out from the water, I switch in the script. I switch from one shader to another, and I also switch the the skybox so that uh, you have one skybox here and another skybox here and this skybox can be affected by the fog while this one is, um, is not affected by the fog so uh, what you get is three shaders the shader from the top, the shader from the bottom and the shader from the skybox <coughs> uh, the interesting thing with the skybox uh, thing is that you can put a reef, beautiful reef, uh, in the underwater skybox, and it will switch correctly from the sky to the reef, and you don't have to do anything. You just have to change the skybox, and set the fog off. Uh, so here is my ocean shader. I hope you enjoy it. And uh, see you soon in another video where I will show you uh, what's going on in inside from inside the um, Unity editor and how you can change the parameters and the colors and everything. 
Thank you.